this is part i don't know how many of dollar tree christmas finds so enjoy the video and if you missed all the other parts they are on my channel so check them out so you can see everything dollar tree has Dollar Tree always has tons of cute containers for Christmas. You could fill these with candy, use them for gifts or treats. Here are some new signs that I saw with a little burlap banner. Those are cute. The light up necklaces are fun, I think especially for teachers. And they have their Snuggadoo socks. These make great stocking stuffers or gifts to add to a gift basket. Or you could even roll up one of these socks and put them in those little containers. I think I like that one the best. Got their little trees back. This is new. Look at this gnome guy. He needs a little fluff up, but that's way cute. Their little garlands. Flip you around here to see these cute signs with the wooden beads. And I think those were the only two I could find. They always have the door hangers for the holidays. And look at this tray. Like I've said, I'm over the red truck, but it's a Buffalo check red truck. And a Buffalo check hat with some fur. And don't skip on Dollar Tree mugs. I think they are cuter than Targets and Targets you're gonna pay uh, anywhere from three to eight dollars for them. And I think these are just as cute there are some even cuter ones later on. Here are some little sacks. Trying to see what's back here. They have these bins again from last year. Again, perfect for making a little gift basket and this one is more of a sleigh shape. And I love how they are doing these for every season and holiday. I feel like they could have made these maybe a little bit cuter for Christmas. I don't know. I really like the holly berry one that says believe, but some of the others I didn't love so much. Um little ball shooter, Santa or a reindeer. Here are some more containers, fresh cut trees, the snowflakes, baking spirits bright. I love gingerbread theme items. Here are some pretty glittery stars. They do have a place in the back for a little votive candle, which would look really pretty at night to burn, or an LED candle. And then these are cool. It's a poinsettia candle. It's kind of got an interesting shape. Here are some fun headbands. Oh, there's my stomach. It always growls <laughs> when I'm doing these voiceovers. Look at these earmuffs. I can't. Pulling out some of their pot holders. I remember these from last year. And they have so many cute cards. This is where you should get your cards, especially if you have a lot to mail out. Because you get quite a few in a pack for a dollar and they have some really pretty ones. Sorry, there are all kinds of background noises right now. Ooh, 
that's a pretty little snowy scene. And some of the candy. I love Dollar Tree's Halloween and Christmas candy, but especially Christmas. I think because I just like chocolate and peppermint or yeah, peppermint. And they have a lot of fun, unique stuff. Like a Santa filled with chocolate balls. They always have their little chocolate boxes. I actually love the red truck one. Maybe I'm not over the red truck. I don't know. The Andes mints. Those are always really good. And you can even give someone a bag of coal if they've been naughty. <laughs> look, these are Andy snap bars. Those look good. I feel like that would be more than a dollar somewhere else. Peppermint bark. Let me know what you guys think about the Palmer's chocolate. I bought these hot cocoa bombs to try all test them out on my Instagram. And then I think the chocolate stirring spoons are good. Some people say they think they're yucky because it's not like real chocolate, but I think they're good. And I love this old school Rudolph. And then look at this sipper mini peppermint cup. These junior mints are amazing. It's just like a junior mint with an extra crunch. And then the candy cane spoons. I've heard they're gross, but they look cute. <laughs> Here are some tins. You've got the Santa, the penguin, and I think there are two or three different sizes. And then I'm just gonna kind of quickly go through these because there are so many. They have a round size. I mean, a round shape. and Christmas colored pool noodles, and look how pretty these are. I think they're wax melts, wax warmer melter things. <laughs> and they're covered in glitter, <laughs> of course. That green is pretty. I love these holly berry mats. Here are some containers that are really great for like cookies or brownies because they're so big and flat. And they had more cute hats. I love the prints on these. Some scarves, reversible sequins. Those are back from last year. I don't recall seeing these, but I feel like they aren't new. Here are some yard stakes. There's a reindeer. A snowman. A Santa. And a cute little elf. Oh, I like him. He's cute. Let's try to light one of these up, see what they look like, and wah wah, doesn't work. I love these. I feel like you could hang these outside in your trees, they're solar powered, you could just hang them on some branches, and get a really cool look like your tree has giant bulbs. Here is some ribbon. for the crafters or even for gifts. I don't think I've seen that pretty blue one before. We've got the red chargers out and then the Buffalo check cookies for Santa. Those are glass and these are probably one of my favorite Dollar Tree plates ever. I just like how simple it is, and those are also glass. Um, I know they have the mugs and then the tumblers, like you see here. I bought those last year, and I love them. And then they didn't have them here today, but there's also a bowl and then the smaller sized plates. And look at these, so pretty. 
Imagine buying a few and making like a little snowy scene with some lights. These are back from last year as well. Here are some glitter votive candles. I'm curious to see how they would burn. I saw red, gold, and silver. I feel like there should be a green. Maybe I just missed it. I know these plush elves are pretty popular. There were a whole bunch here. And look at these, what would you call it? A crushed velvet bow? Oh my gosh, they have this like champagne color, a gold one, and then that pretty maroon. And here are some signs. There are some repeats from last year and also a few new ones. And of course, glitter, glitter, glitter all over. Just hit it with some hairspray and that'll usually keep it from falling everywhere. These are new, the tag shape signs, the trailer, and of course, the glittery red truck. <laughs> Now these are, that's, that's a creepy Santa. I don't like that one. The snowman, he's okay. I could accept that one, but I don't like that Santa. And look at this, some golden lights, green. And then they have this ribbon type stuff. I bought some of this, so I will put some batteries in there and see what I think of it. I got it in the green and the red. And then they have the candy cane looking one. And these, oh, I love these. I didn't know which one to buy, but I ended up getting the hot cocoa treat ones to go in my kitchen. Again, these make awesome gifts. You can buy a whole matching set for just a few dollars. And then they have these plates too. And these are, I don't know if the word is glass, but it's hard to tell if they're that like melamine material or glass. Those ones are the ceramic glass <gasps> and look at this he was chipped though that santa is cute and these were a really big size and they felt really nice quality i think they have funny sayings on there too express your elf love the gnome for the holidays of course and slaying it I swear Target has almost that same mug and it's not a dollar. I love that one too. And that I love I want them all. Thanks for watching and happy hunting. Bye guys.